It's interesting, isn't it? Because we do want to sell ourselves. You go for a job interview, you want to sell yourself. Of course you do. You have a CV, you have a covering letter, you want to say, well, I'm great at this and I'm great at that. Because if you say, well, I'm rubbish at this, I'm rubbish at that, that's not going to work. But also, if you say, I'm great at this, I'm great at that, that also can sound arrogant. So what's the, the, the middle ground? And I think the middle ground is to use, and this is what I use, is use third-party endorsement. So put your words into somebody else's mouth. So, for example, if it's a job interview, if someone said to me, how would you describe yourself? I could say, well, you know, I give 150%. I think I'm really, really experienced. I'm really good. People love me. People always would come for repeat business or whatever. It looks like I'm desperately trying to sell myself. But if I put those words, fictitiously possibly, into the mouth of someone else, it sounds much better. So if I said, well, you know, if they said, how would you describe yourself? And I could say, well, I hope if you ask my clients, they would say that I always give 150%, that I've really helped them and helped develop them. You know, I hope if you ask some of the junior people I've worked with, they would say this. I hope if you ask some of the senior people, they might say this. So you can put your thoughts in the mouth of someone else and it sounds much less braggy.